What's up guys, welcome back to Mr. Legend Crypto guys. In this video, we'll be taking a look at an all coins, Gnosis. Gnosis is currently ranked number 88 on CoinMarketCap. In the last one year, it has gone as high as $1,000 and as low as $96. Currently, Gnosis is trading for $146. In this video, we'll be taking a look at the Gnosis US dollar price chart, Gnosis performance against Bitcoin, Gnosis performance against Ethereum, and then we'll take a look at the Gnosis market cap chart. How low can it go in the bear market? Should we start accumulating some Gnosis right now? Is it the right time to be buying? How high will it go in the next bull run? Do you want to hold it through the bear market? We'll be answering all those questions in this video. But first, guys, if you're new to this channel, and you like this video please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this turn on the post notification you won't get notified anytime i drop a new video let's get down to business Guys, at the point of recording this video, in the last one year, Gnosis is down 20%, but in the last one month, it's up 26.8%. In the last one week, it's up 31.9%. So do you want to be holding some Gnosis through the bear market? Right now, the altcoin market is tanking. It looks as if the relief rally is over. Before we look at the Gnosis US dollar price chart, let's look at some technical details about Gnosis. We have only 26% of the maximum supply in circulation. We have 10 million tokens. That's the maximum supply. We have 2.5 million of those tokens in circulation. And the 24-hour trading volume at the point to record on this video is 9.4 million dollars it has a fully directed market cap of 1.4 billion dollars currently the market caps are 376 million dollars what is gnosis and why do you want to hold it through the bear market gnosis dio builds decentralized infrastructure for the ethereum ecosystem in november 2021 both the x dio and gnosis dio community voted to combine their vibrant ecosystem to create the gnosis chain an ethereum front runner company that addresses scaling issues through solid engineering where can you get some if you want to buy some to hold through the bear market before you look at the price chart you can get some on binance hugo global git.io Kraken, Bitfinex, and anywhere you get your favorite all coins. Let's look at the JNO US dollar price chart. And this is the price chart for JNO from 2017 till 2022. We have five years of price history. We can see what JNO did in the previous bear market and how it behaved in the bull run and how we should expect it to behave in this current bear market. In the previous bear market, and JNO rose from as high as $460. It dumped really down. It found its bottom during the COVID sell-off in March 2020. It dropped 98 percent from its all-time high and it took 798 days for it to finish dumping bitcoin found its bottom right here in december 2018 gnosis had a relief rally it pumped around 200 percent and then it dumped further down again you want to be careful with these all coins during the bear market guys even though if they have a relief rally even though if the pump you think the pump is over they can still dump to the downside because the bear market is for accumulation the bear market is for the market to be going sideways not upwards most times the market will be going downwards but if you are smart in the market you want to be accumulating in that period in time so the million dollar question is do you want to be accumulating GNO in that period in time? And what price will you be accumulating some GM? What price will it sound reasonable to accumulate some? Because you can see in the previous bear market, first GNO lost 98% of its value from the all-time high of 460. Then we found the low right here. The all-time low came in at $8.8. And if you got some GNO that day, guys, you would have been singing Kumbaya. The bear market for accumulating. The bear market is where all the riches are made. And if you had bought GNO in the bear market, the depths of the bear market, at the top of the bull run, you would have been happy because GNO returned over 10,000 percent in 623 days it went from as low as 8.8 dollars .8 to as high as 901 dollar it got to as high as 1000 dollars on some exchanges so now do you want to be holding through the bear market from the all-time high for jno that came in around 901 dollar it has been dumping really hard it has dumped below 100 dollars and do you want to hold some through the bear market for the all-time high that came from jno at the top at one thousand dollars right now it has been dumping really hard it has lost 88 percent of its value it got to as low as hundred dollars is that the bottom should we start buying some jno right now because guys we know that during the bear market all coins actually can lose from 90 to 99 percent of their value we just saw the case of jno right here in the previous bear market it lost over 98 percent of its value if it's going to lose just 86 percent of its value in this bear market we'll see jno trading for around 100 dollars where it got to but is that the absolute bottom guys you want to be careful because even after all this all coins show you that maybe they are at the bottom maybe they are very very cheap if you get them 
and you might be singing kumbaya when we go back to the top but you still want to be careful because they can still continue dumping you can see that since when jno found this top right here the only bounce we had was this little bounce that we had we had this little bounce in january entering march 2022 we had that bounce got people faked out a lot of people are calling for all-time highs uh two thousand dollars one thousand five hundred what happened to jno after that it dumped really hard and we had more than 11 consecutive weeks of red candles right now we're having some green candles and you can see that this price region where we are right now for jno this hundred dollar region has been a critical level for jno when we we're dumping in 2019 when we got that small relief in may 2018 jno consolidated around this 100 to 120 dollar region is that what's happening right now can jno comfortably stay around this 120 dollar region because guys if 120 dollar region doesn't hold for jno we might see jno do something like this maybe pump to as high as 250 dollars and then to come down to 50 dollars is that possible very very possible in the bear market remember guys any Anytime you see crazy pumps like this, Geno went up over 10,000 percent in less than 700 days. Uh, anytime you see any crazy pump like this, expect another version of crazy dump because with all crazy pumps come crazy dumps. The same effort that push it upwards is the same effort that will push it downwards. That's just the way it rolls. Now, how is Geno performing against Bitcoin and how is it performing against Ethereum? When Geno topped right here against Bitcoin on the 20th of June 2017, it started dumping and it dumped really hard. And it found this bottom on this Bitcoin pairing right here after dumping for over 800 days on the 2nd of September 2019. Crazy, crazy dump. In that period in time, Geno lost over 99.14% against Bitcoin. But if you got Geno right here at the bottom, when it was an all time low against Bitcoin, you could have been singing Kumbaya because it topped right here on the 27th December 2021 against Bitcoin after outperforming Bitcoin in the corresponding 847 days by 818%. That's actually nice to see. It's not plenty of coins that can actually say they outperform Bitcoin in that period in time. Right now, in the last 30 days, JNO is not performing well against Bitcoin. It has been dumping. Since when the market started pumping, JNO has lost over 56% on its Bitcoin value. So do you want to be holding some JNO through the bear market? Do you want to be flipping your Bitcoin for some JNO right now? And that would be a smart decision, guys. You can see from past previous history, you can see from previous history that JNO during the bear market, yes, you might have some pump here and there, but the general trend is downwards. The general trend is towards zero against Bitcoin. Now, a lot of these altcoins, yes, when the bull market comes, they will pump against Bitcoin. You can see in the case of JNO, it pumped against Bitcoin, but it couldn't set a new all-time high. A lot of these altcoins will probably never set new all-time highs against bitcoin and the market has proven that maybe just maybe bitcoin is one of a kind and these all coins are just different coins in different sizes yes jen will probably perform well in the next bull run but you want to be careful with it during the bear market how is it performing against the number one altcoin in the market jeno has been tanking really hard against ethereum the people that flipped their ethereum for some jeno right now are really really sad because guys jeno lost over 95% of its value since when it topped against Ethereum in 2017. Will it be able to set a new all-time high against Ethereum? Probably not. And Geno pumped in 2021, but even that pump in 2021 was nothing to write home about for Geno against Ethereum. Because from the bottom for Geno against Ethereum right here, it just pumped and it came to a top in September 2021, a 182% pump. It came back in 2021 to Test that top again, 189% pump in total from the bottom for GNO against Ethereum. And since then, it has been dumping really hard. Since the beginning of the year, GNO has been dumping really hard against Ethereum. It has dumped more than 39%. How low will it go against Ethereum? Will it set a new all-time low during the bear market? Are we going to see GNO set new all-time highs against Ethereum in the next bull run? Probably not. The all-time high for GNO against Ethereum was around 1.33. That means you could flip one GNO for how Ethereum went was launched. Crazy, crazy if you think about it, that right now Ethereum is trading for over $1,400 and you can get one GNO for just $146. Crazy, crazy. Are we going to see new all-time highs for the Bitcoin pairing? Probably not anytime soon. Are we going to see all-time highs for the Ethereum pairing? Probably not anytime soon, but guys, the bear market is where you want to be accumulating. This is a good accumulation point. You don't want to be buying all these green candles. You want to wait for the pullbacks. You want to wait for when everybody's shouting, we are going to zero. When the market is in extreme fear, the market was in extreme fear for two months on. Right now, we're in fear. Probably still a good time to buy. Let's say look at Gnosis market cap chart. Gnosis market cap um, valuation went to as high as $1.3 billion at the top of the bull run. The top for Gnosis came here on the 15th of November 2021. The previous all-time high for Gnosis market cap was around $500 million. That 
that top came in on the 1st of January 2018 and after that Gnosis dumped really hard it dumped 98% in 800 days the market cap went to as low as 8 million dollars crazy crazy but when the bull run came when the market went up only when everything looked easy in the market rigs off everything was pumping to the moon what happened to Gnosis at that period in time it went from a market cap of 8 million dollars to as high as 1.3 billion dollars mad mad if you think about it uh, right now Gnosis is at the previous all-time high it's chilling at the previous all-time high of around 380 400 million dollar region and will it break that level we don't want to see it break that level if the market cap cannot hold that level we might see Gnosis going to gobbling town and gobbling town for Gnosis means the market cap might come back to test lower regions it might come back to test this 160 million dollar region and if that region doesn't hold we might be going to real deep gobbling town and that's around the 59 million dollar region even in that region Gnosis is still up from the bear market bottoms so i will not be expecting really mad pumps from it right now it's still really high from the bottom from where we are right now for gnosis is still up over four thousand percent do you want to be holding through the bear market guys drop your thoughts in the comment section what will you be doing with your journal through the bear market will you be flipping in for some ethereum will you be flipping in for some bitcoin or will you be holding through the chaos or probably you sell into the pump expecting lower prices drop your thoughts in the comment section thank you for watching this video please don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this turn on the post notification if you want to get notified anytime i drop a new video see you guys in my next video